how to add custom dynamic content in your collapsible rows in your product page hey everyone welcome i hope you're all doing great i will show you how to do that step by step so first uh if we just go ahead and open up our uh product page here we can actually first add the uh collapsible row so we can just go to our default product page and by default you shouldn't have one you would want to just click on add block and then from here you should find collapsible row click on that and it's just going to add that for you now if you want to add these settings to the or access the settings to it you can just click on it and you'll be able to change a few things like the heading and icon and stuff um I'm just going to leave it as it is and then we can just go ahead and add the raw content but if you want to connect your uh, custom dynamic source you would want to set this up so how do we actually do this it's very simple we can just save out of this and exit you want to just go to settings from the shopify main dashboard and then from here we want to scroll down until we find meta fields now i can't really find it so let me just go ahead and find it real quick okay so i've actually found it it's from within the custom data option so just click on custom data and then you would want to click on products then you would want to just click on add definition from here we are just basically going to give it a name i'm just uh you would want to obviously give it a name accordingly but i'm just going to name it test and then we can just go ahead and also add a description if you would like. So uh, another test maybe. And then select the type. So usually it's going to be single line or multi-line. I'm just going to select multi-line text. Uh, and then once that's done, I'm just going to leave the rest as it is and click on save. Now we can actually go ahead and add that to our collapsible row. So if we just go to exit out of here and we just go to back to our online store and click on customize we can actually add it to our default product page. And I will show you then how to actually add uh, different, um, you know, lines and stuff to each product separately. So first, uh, let's just go ahead and add it to our row. So click on collapsible row. And then we just want to click on uh, raw content here. You'd want to just to click on the uh, so connect dynamic source which is just going to give you this option, which is still did not change, but you want to click on it, click product, and then you have the test one, which we have just created. Click on it. And we should be almost done. So the next step, click on save. And we just want to exit out of here. And we want to go to the product section. Click on the product that we want to add that meta field to. Uh, and then we just want to scroll down until we find this. So here you'd want to add the text that you want to add. So it could be whatever it may be. So we can just add uh, more testing. And because this is multi-line, so we can actually go ahead, enter and add more text in here and click on save. And we can also do this for the rest of the product. So we can just go back do the same thing for this other product, but I'm not going to do it just to save you time. And if we just click on online store again, one more time, and if we just click actually to preview it and we go to the uh, purple product, uh, we can actually see now we have everything that we want in the uh, collapsible row. So this is pretty much all there is to it. So hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching.